Senua. The outcast who became a warrior, who faced her demons and challenged the gods for her lover's soul, has accepted the voices, the furies, as part of herself. Just like her mother, Galena, she was not like other people. She saw and heard the world differently. Her father, Zinbel, told her she was evil, tainted by the sin of her mother. Tormented and afraid, she retreated from the world. Until love broke through like the rays of a new dawn. In Dillian's acceptance, she could live again. He gave light to her mind and freed a warrior from her body. But the voice of her father stayed with her, reminding her of her curse. And when the plague came to her land, the people blamed Senua. She took her darkness with her, banishing herself to the wilds. So she was not there when the Northmen massacred her people and sacrificed Dillian to the god of hell. Senua's torment was so deep that the world around her fell away she took the head of her beloved, the vessel of his soul, and vowed to go to hell herself to save him. Through mist-shrouded horrors, she fought to find the secret path that would lead her to the very gates of hell. But the way was marked by fire and illusion. Senua had to fight the gods that guarded these paths and stave off the rot which threatened to consume her mind and end her life. Only conquest could open the gates. Only blood would bring her face to face with Hela. Face to face with defeat. Once again, Senua was engulfed in darkness, lost in a maze of misery and confusion. Until Dillian's voice led her to the promise of victory, a sword that could kill a god. To win the sword, Senua would drown in her darkest memories, pulling at the shards lodged in flesh, mind and soul. She pressed deeper into the underworld, resisting its grasping hands and deafening cries, until she found her prize before the guardian of Hell's gates. Senua released her rage, a fury that could not be stopped, not by savage jaws, not by waves of warriors, not by the pull of death itself. In defeat and desperation, Senua begged for her beloved's release. But a sacrifice must be made, and burdens cast away. Senua's fate was never in the hands of the gods, but in her own. Only she could choose out of love to live, to go on, and to take us with her. It's been a long time. 
she made a promise to the one she loved. Dead now, but no less. A promise. Not one soul more would suffer as he had. She carries him in her heart. His death, his life, will drive her on. She will forge a purpose from his death. Make meaning from the pain. And then the Northmen came again to our land. And stripping us of our names, our lives. Of everything that makes us who we are. Beating and blinding. Taking us as slaves. These Northmen sail under a blood red sign. She let herself be taken, dragged in chains to their ships, so she can trace the poison to its source, find the heart, and cut it out. Stop the slaves. Keep her promise. But plans can drift off course. begins as it ends, alone in the dark. Even when you're pulled by forces dim and vast, fate can stop you cold. A dream has foundered with the ship. She must find a new light to steer by and find the next sign. This dark land, it pushes 
comes back. She's so far from home, from all she's ever known, half drow. Lost in a world still crowded to her eyes. But she won't yield. She must fight on, as she always has. Remember, we've been to hell before. There it is. This is only the beginning. Where is everyone? You need to climb again. She will fall if she does. She will die. Climb, Senua. Climb, climb. She's hurt. So tired. She's going to fall. No! Careful, Senua. draw her onward. The ones who didn't live. The ones she could not save. She can hear them calling. Lives stolen by the Northmen. She carries them with her. Always. She is afraid, exhausted. She won't stop. Stronger forces drive her on. Someone. 
Listen, she needs you. She needs help. She needs you to go to her quickly. She's dying. That shit is pathetic. She needs you. Way. The signs are leading me. They brought me here. She knows that all through this world there are signs and symbols waiting to be discovered. The meaning is there. If only you can find it. Out of hell you have come, and now find yourself in Midgard, the world of men. Do not think it any less dangerous for that. Your path has taken you far from home, across the boundless sea, and you must go on to the heart of this place, to the heart of man. You have seen how the Northmen journey out to conquer. And this is one of their lands, as icy dark as Niflheim, yet as fiery as Muspel. It has not long been claimed, and they try still to tame it. Too weak to help. Follow him. Be ready to fight. She is a warrior. A warrior with no sword. No weapon. She came here with nothing. What good are you to anyone with no weapon? He will kill you. He will. Survivors. 
I need to help the other slaves. Remember why we came here. She came here for a reason. And now she doesn't know what to do. You don't know where you're going. Your plan is in pieces. She is lost. Or lost. In the slaver, the master is gone. I have to help them. You thought you could stop this. But you have lost your mark. The sea tore him away. Just like your hopes. You don't need to listen to him. You know this man. Listen to us. You know better. Find the survivor. He is trying to trick you. We need to help the survivors. save them. They're already dead. The lost ones. Don't listen to him. Listen to us, listen not to him. him. You're a liar! Get to the sea. Find your way back to the sea. That is where they need your help. But you can never escape. She will never escape. Get out of here. You have to find a way out of here. You are lost too. She must find a way out. How can the loss find anyone? Listen to me. Listen. You failed them. Don't listen to him. They are dead, like your mother. Hey, shut up! Like Make him shut up! Oh, stop it! Yeah. 
survivors. Don't listen to the dead, just move on and find the survivors. Find somewhere to hide. Don't be 
we cannot fight. It has to be you. You. Don't here. She has to survive. You must. You have to survive for us. You made a promise.
What are you going to do with that sword, girl? She looks ready for you. He is ready to fight. You're ready. We will end this. You're fucking dead. Oh, you think this is the end? Be better! 
You're gonna take me where I need to go. Yes. She knew the path would open to her. A blood-carved stave, a salt sea falling, a too familiar darkness, an endless night. He is the next sign. Sign. What is it? You need to understand. You need to understand. Answer! It is my father, Sigil. His father. Your father. Huh? The Gothi. Monster. He's here. <laughs> Look at him. No. But this place is his. The people here are weak. They would not survive without his help. You like you. Does she? Enough! He's wounded. He won't try 